welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going over a Walmart and Target collective haul. And this is just stuff I've been collecting for a couple months now. Like in the process of me like thinking if I want to do a YouTube channel. And I was like, okay, you're going to do the YouTube channel. You're going to keep these products and show them on your YouTube channel. So yeah, these things are kind of older but they still are like every like all year round type of products and just stuff that's still relevant you can still find in stores i'm pretty sure for the most part um so yes i hope you guys enjoy the video and like and subscribe and put a comment down in the bottom if you like the video what videos you might want to see next and thank you so much for the support so far for everyone that's tuned in to my videos and also you can go and check some of my last ones. I have my first empties video and also my Bath and Body Works and my annual sale haul. And before I get into my haul today, um, I just want to share a small black owned business. And this is Alani Cosmetics, one of my best dear friends from high school. Um, owns a cosmetic line called Alani Cosmetics. And I'll leave the website in the description, but I purchased um, a lip liner and a lip gloss. And the packaging is so cute. It's like a holographic um, box for the pencil and then this like pastel uh, multicolored box for the lip gloss. And this is what I have on my lips today. And I added um, just a clear gloss on top from Ulta. Oops, okay. Yes, but this is what I have on my lips today and I just added on a clear gloss on top just to blend everything together. But this is the pencil. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is the lip liner. It says Alani on the pencil and it's in the color cinnamon. If that shows up. And if you guys want to see what I have, it's kind of like a um, burnt orange um, color. I mean, not burnt orange, a burnt red, like a cinnamon brown color. And then this lip gloss is in the color Sweet Dreams. And this is like a cute um, frosted pink um shimmer gloss it has like a little bit of shimmer but it does have like a a nice color payoff to it and i just lined my lips and filled in my lips with the pencil and then i put the um, gloss on top pat it on a little bit and then i just put on some clear gloss to blend everything together so yeah if you guys want to check out the business um, and purchase some cosmetics and I will leave their description, um, their link in the description below. Okay, so the first items I'm going to show are shaving products from Target. So everything I'm going to show right now is from Target. Um, so the first thing I have is the Cremo Shave Cream and Coconut Mango. And if y'all watch my videos... <laughs> Y'all already know I love coconut, so this smells really good. And coconut and the mango is like a perfect combination because the coconut isn't too strong and then the mango isn't too strong. So that's the first thing I have from Target. And then I got the 10 Skin Solution to help with um, ingrown hairs, razor bumps um, after you get done shaving. So when I went to my wax lady, um, she was like, oh, this is really good to use to prevent like razor bumps and grown hair. So I picked up a small thing of that because it's kind of pricey. So I just wanted a small bottle of it. Okay, so the next few things I have are from Soap and Glory. And it's actually, I guess you can call it like a trio of things. And I got these actually on clearance at Target. And I think I got this maybe like in July or so. Um, I think each of these are probably like $4. So it's a really good clearance deal. So the first thing I have 
is the Shower Ranger um, Cooling Body Wash and the original pink scent, which is a fruity and floral scent. Um, I think it's like a, it's really, it's really pretty, it's nice. Um, so this is like really, it would have been really nice in the summertime and I didn't even use it. <laughs> I haven't used it yet. So like on those days when like you just want to like feel refreshed after you're like out in the heat and stuff all day. Um, and then I got the lotion to match it. It's called the Lotion Activated in the same scent. So yeah, it's kind of like a, kind of like a rosy, maybe like grapefruit scent. Excuse me. And then I also got the end shower moisturizer and it's also like part of the uplifting um, collection, like refreshing type of collection. I guess this is all part of, I think. So yeah, I got the wash, the end shower lotion, and then the lotion outside of the shower. So that is all from Soap and Glory. So I'm gonna go over some body washes I picked up from Target. And this is the Target brand, Up and Up brand, Reviving Body Wash and Pomegranate and Lemon Verbena scent. Um, so this is really nice. Mm. Yeah, that's really nice. It's so, the pomegranate is so refreshing and the lemon just, this would have been really nice on a hot like summer day and I haven't used it yet. But you know, sometimes like if you're in the house and like deep cleaning and all that stuff and like you kind of get kind of hot and warm, I feel like something like that would come in handy. And also I have two Caress body washes. I have the Shea Butter and Brown Sugar and the Tahitian Pomegranate and Coconut Milk. And yeah, this one smells good too. This pomegranate smells good, but I think I like the Target one better. And then the Shea Butter Caress, it's like a classic OG. That one smells good as well. And the last, I think this is, yeah, this is the last shower gel from Target. It's one of my favorites for like all year round, but especially now in the fall. That's coming up. This is the OGX Smoothing Coconut and Coffee Shower Gel. Scrub and wash, it smells so good. Mm. It's like, you're like literally bathing in a cup of coffee or like a latte, iced coffee. It just smells so good. And I would recommend this to like literally any and everybody to get that. coconut coffee lotion from OGX to go with the shower gel and I don't think I ever used the lotion before because when I first found this product like last year or so I don't think I could ever find the lotion so when I found the lotion and I got these things in the summertime and I'm like I'm probably not gonna use them right now because it's the summertime but like when you find stuff like this you just have to grab it when you find it because Otherwise, once the fall and winter time comes around, like that type of thing is going to be so hard to find. So I would definitely recommend you buying it now. And the next lotion I have is an OG. It's the Cherry Almond Jargons Lotion. It's just a very pretty and refreshing cherry almond scent. And this is just a classic lotion that you probably use had in your household at one point or the other and the next lotion I have is the Nivea breathable lotion and I think this is like one of those it's a new lotion for this summer but it's like been like all the hype on like TikTok and stuff like that I think this girl like kind of made it popular on TikTok and this scent is the tropical breeze scent and it smells really good um I like this one the best out of I think they had another scent I don't remember what it was, but I think it was like a green lettering on here. But I like the Tropical Breeze. This lotion I got is the Shea Butter and Sandalwood Body Lotion from Love, Beauty, and Planet. And it looks like that. And this, I just picked it up because it was just a nice, sweet 
warm shea butter scent and the sandalwood made it kind of like um like a soothing like more like gourmand type of scent so i think this smells really good um and i would recommend this one if you're looking for like a nice fall transitioning lotion it has a really nice scent to it in my opinion and the next lotion i have is the eos 24 hour moisture body lotion and the pomegranate raspberry and this smells really good i love i'm like really into raspberry like uh recently and this just smells really good um it's not like a bad artificial raspberry in my opinion i think it smells pretty nice um and it has a pomegranate in here as well so i'm excited to try this product and eos is a very popular brand when it comes to their lotions so i would definitely check this out as well if i were you guys and pick this up because eos lotions are also hard to come by because they're so popular and the next few things i got are some perfumes from the mix box so the first one i have is the cloud musk perfume by mix bar and the nice thing about mix bar is that it's pretty literally what it says you can mix and match all the fragrances that they have um so this one i liked it because it reminded me of my favorite men's cologne that i got from my boyfriend like twice so far because i love it so much and he loves it the prada luna rosa sport cologne it smells so good almost like a unisex manly sporty rosy type of um cologne and this reminds me of it so much it smells so good it smells so good like if you want to like have like that kind of like masculine scent on you like on a really cold day and you just want to feel like really um like you're cozy up with somebody but you really aren't so i think that's like a really good like perfume to have and i also got the matching body spray and also it's a hair mist as well so you can put that in your hair or you know on your wig whatever you want to do and then the next fragrance i got from mix bar is the blackberry tonic and this one is just um a nice blackberry blackberry currant type of um scent and it's just like very juicy and but like perfumey and it just smells really nice I think it's really nice for like the fall time, just like that deeper berry, like dark berry scent to have on your skin. So that's really nice as well. I think that might mix really nice with like the cloud musk as well. And I also got the coconut palm body spray and hair mist to match with the perfume that I have for the um, perfume which I already have in my collection. So I think I have a total of three of the Cloud Musk, excuse me, a total of three of the Mix Bar perfume. Those are the perfumes that I got from Target from the Mix Bar. I'm gonna end off my Target portion of the haul. I have a couple of things I actually picked up today. And I'm gonna start off with, um, Let's see, this one right here, which I hear a lot of people find it hard to find this product, but my Target, thankfully, always has this in stock. And I'm like, girl, just grab it because everybody loves it. So, and this is the Method Berry Balance Body Wash. And it has acai, mulberry, and goji berry. And I think it's like a really refreshing berry scent. It almost gives me like, I don't know, like a hint of like blueberry vibes for some reason like a blueberry muffin but yeah i did go ahead and pick this up today because i'm like just grab it because everybody like loves it so and i don't want to miss out on it so i grabbed it and then this is also another very popular item from eos and this is their vanilla cashmere lotion i've never tried this but so many people speak highly of this lotion and um I don't know. I, I always smelt it when I went to the store. I'm like, it's a nice vanilla, but 
maybe it's the cashmere that's throwing me off and I like cashmere, but somehow mixed in with this one, it, uh, it wasn't like my favorite scent, but I'm like, let me just take it home and try it out. It kind of gives me like a burnt, like caramel, caramel type of scent to it. So I'll see once I actually use it and see if I like it. And then something I'm trying to get into because I really don't like going to the nail salon and like sitting at the nail salon all day and then eventually the nails just chip or break going back and blah 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 so i picked up some press on nails um and these are from clutch nails it's kind of like an ombre pink to white set and also um i get like an allergic reaction to like whatever they use to do like acrylics and stuff so um, I'm like, let me just try some press on nails in the meantime before I decide to go back and maybe go back and get manicures. Really cute things in the travel section at Target. And the first thing I found was this Method Body Wash in a travel size in the Pure Peace set. And this has peony, rose water, and pink sea salt. And it's like a really pretty floral rose rosy scent um so hopefully it's not like too overbearing with the rose um once you get in the shower because i'm like not like the biggest like rose person so we'll see and then they also have the olay strawberry and mint body wash and i wasn't like the biggest fan of this smell that's why I didn't grab it in the big one when I smelt it. I smell like strawberry milk when I just smelt it, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll see once I get it in the shower if I would like to purchase the big size of it. And then um, some shaving products that I found that just look really cute and amusing. <laughs> um, I got the Skintimate Raspberry Rain Shaving Cream. This was in the sh um, the travel um department i'm like that looks really cute and i'm like on a raspberry kick right now so i got that and then i also got the eos shea butter shave cream and this is in the pomegranate raspberry set so i thought this was really cute as well so i grabbed that and i got the hand food hand cream um and the original pink rose and bergamot scent from Soap and Glory. So I grabbed this in the real travel area. And I also picked up the Dr. Bronner's Pure Castell Soap and the Baby Unscented. And I've heard a lot of good things about this one. A lot of people use this, like their downstairs area. So we'll see um, um, if I use this or not i'm not 100 percent sure about that and i also picked up the native travel size deodorant and cucumber and mint and i had one and coconut but it's been like in my purse for so long that when i went to use it one day like it was like turn turning brown so i guess i had it for too long um but yeah so i picked up a new travel size deodorant Okay, you guys so the next part of the haul is gonna be my Walmart items and actually I'm gonna add on some Myers items so if you have a Myers grocery store maybe you might live in the Midwest so I think they're mainly in the Midwest so these are some things I picked up at Myers as well so first for the Walmart items I picked up the Shea soft and smooth body wash by OGX and this one, this one is really popular right now. Really nice to go into the fall time because it's like that really um, warm shea butter scent. And I wish I could find the lotion to go with it. I've heard some people found the lotions at Ross, which I think I might have seen one at Ross, but I think the bottle was like kind of beat up and it was the last one. <laughs> And I was like, no, nah, I don't want to get it because it was beat up. So, yes, I have the body wash. And then the next item I have is the Johnson's Almond Oil Baby Oil. 
Um, I just heard really good things about this from people on YouTube. Um, so I went ahead and picked up this. So yes, that's in my collection. I also have a couple other Johnson's products as well that I really like. So I grabbed that. And the next thing I got from Walmart is the Shea Sugar Scrub from Tree Hut and the Exotic Bloom scents. This is like one of their, I guess, more basic scents that you can always kind of find in stores. And it's like a really pretty floral scented um, body scrub. So I got that from Walmart. And the last thing I have from Walmart is a very popular thing right now, and they only had this in the small sizes. So I got the last two that were on the shelves, and this is the Body Fantasies Cupcake Swirl Body Sprays. And these smell really good, you guys. Um, yeah, these don't have fragrance notes, but I know it has like a hint of ginger in here. Um, it's like a very cakey... The ginger is an off-putting. Um, it like blends in really well and makes it like a warmer, like more welcoming type of yummy scent. It kind of gives it like a spice to the scent, but not like a super strong off-putting spiciness, like a strong cinnamony spice. But it smells so good. It almost reminds me of like like a carrot cake has like that spicy not like a spicy but like that gingery type of taste or something like a pumpkin pie or like a sweet potato pie but it settles down so nice it's like a cakey nice cakey scent so those are the things i got from walmart so i'm going to move on to the last part of the haul which should be the final part because i'm like keep finding things around my room and i'm like oh my god you need to add that to the video but the last part of the haul is going to be my Myers items. All right, so the last part are my Myers items. Once again, a grocery store. Um, so I guess today is like a grocery store type of vibe. And I have so much stuff from grocery stores I've been piling up and waiting to make this video for you guys. So the first thing I have is the Dove Kids Coconut Cookie um, Foam and Body Wash. And this is kind of hard to open. Let me see. It doesn't really have a strong scent. I'm wondering if I get in the shower if it like what it smells like, but like out the bottle it just smells like soap to me. Like it doesn't give like a gourmand like cookie scent to me. And I got two because it was like buy one get one thirty percent off, and I'm like. But what if you just like it in the shower and like you might as well just have gotten two but I need to stop telling myself that and like girl just try one and see if you like it first like duh <laughs> but you know I couldn't help myself so I got two of those because I've been seeing those on these on like Instagram and part of people's like body care root routine so I was like let me just grab it and then the next thing I was really happy to see because I know um, with Lovely, I believe it's her YouTube name, she talked about the soft soaps or like she might have posted it on her community tab, but it's the soft soap, vanilla and jojoba oil um, body washes. And I have heard people say that they can only get these at like Dollar General. But I was so happy that I found these at my Myers and I just had to grab two of them. And these are popular right now because they're like a really sweet shea butter the jojoba oil it's like a sweetness like almost like a gourmandish like sweet scent to it like a sweet floral like but yet gourmand scent to it so yeah i'm really happy i was able to find these and i grabbed two of them at myers and the next thing I got was another Method body wash. And this is the Coconut Rice Milk and Shea Butter body wash. And it's also a very popular one. So yeah, this is also like a sweet coconut milk. Yeah, definitely because it has coconut, rice milk, and shea butter. Yeah, this one's really 
nice kind of like in that gourmand family of body washes and i also have this olay fresh out blast orchid and black currant body wash and i think this one smells really good from like that olay collection that kind of has like this imagery on it on it and i just love like that those like dark berry scents it smells really good it was really nice on like a nice night where you kind of like want to get like kind of like smell really good before you in the bed like i feel like that's a really nice scent or a nice body wash before you go out for the night very nice and i also got this vaseline all over body balm and i got this because i know jasmine bullard she talks about this like to use this to Put on like your pulse points before you put your perfume on and it just helps for like um your perfume to stick and to stay longer and just help with the longevity of your perfume because perfume does not stay long on dry skin so you want to put that on first and then spray your perfume so on your pulse points so your perfume lasts longer so i finally found one of these and grab one at myers and then the last two things that i got from myers is the first one is fancy body spray by jessica simpson and i've been having a really hard time finding the actual perfume and like marshall's and tj maxx and ross and all those places so i was like okay i found the body spray sometimes the body sprays are at like marshall's and stuff but they look so beat up <laughs> and used so i'm like let me just get it at Myers when I found when I saw it there, even though it's a little bit more pricey at Myers. But I wanted it so bad, and it's like a very nice, like caramely, um, floral type of scent. So I grabbed this, and I might just have to end up buying the perfume online. And that's definitely like a this perfume is like one of those like more popular celebrity type perfume so i'm happy i at least got the body spray for now and the very last thing i have for myers and for the haul all together is going to be my pink sugar by aquilina body spray i got this from myers and i was like oh my god they have a body spray like i feel like i have literally everything for this scent now besides like lotions and stuff which i haven't heard really good things about the aquilina pink sugar lotions that they're just not the same or not as good of a quality of a scent as the sprays and perfumes but yeah it smells so good so sugary and sweet so i had to grab one of these when i saw it and like the packaging is so cute the top is a little dirty from spraying it so i gotta clean that out but otherwise it's such a pretty scent i'm happy i found it at myers and that is the last thing for this haul so much for watching my collective haul from Walmart, Target, and I threw in Myers at the last minute as well. So thank you for watching you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead and like the video. Post a comment like where have the recent places that you guys been shopping at that you've been like collecting stuff from and what you might want to see next. I have a lot of hauls coming up because I have so much stuff that I've just been saving up. In the process of me moving so that's why you see like a new background because i have recently moved i'm trying to get my little room together and situated and it's like my first time being able to film so hopefully this video can get up as soon as possible once i can get it edited but yeah once again go ahead and subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for future videos and thank you so much for watching bye